Hey guys, it's Storm here, and today for you I have another epic LEGO, LEGO review. So this review is going to be on a little custom thing I made. It's like a Mando... It's like an RV, but it has a tank, a detachable tank. So, I'll just... This is just going to be an overall review of everything in it. I'll start with the review of the tank alone, then go on to the review of the RV alone and show you some of the features and then show you um, what it looks like driving together and everything. So now I'm going to put this camera on the tripod and I can begin the epic review. Okay, so here we have the actual tank. What it is is this, this compound little vehicle that they can detach from, the, from their whole living RV. Um, um, just to, like, go on missions and stuff. Please ignore any background noise if you hear it. That's why I keep faltering, because there's a lot of background noise. So if there is any background noise... Whoa, that looks really weird, I just noticed. But, um... Yeah, just ignore it. So in the back here, there's a little rotating attachment thing that they can lock into the RV, and then they can, um, just use that, and use the power from this into the RV. Uh, I just pointed at where the RV is. There's a good detailed look at the bottom. You see that's the little thing that has that on. It's got two sets. Is these, are these wheels really off center? Hold on. Sorry, I, I actually, like, had to redo this after, just before filming, so I think I may have messed up the wheels, but, yeah, so the wheels are all back and everything. It's got small wheels on the front and slightly bigger wheels on the back. They work, and they can roll for all terrain coverage and everything. They have armor plating here, no armor plating here. It's, like, completely solid back here. There's, like, absolutely no way you're going to be able to break through these tan and red bricks. And it's a bit more varied over on this side and stuff. I actually took just a normal thin plate and then I widened it out using slant pieces. I mean, like, um, wider, smaller pieces to do that. Um, a big buffering red brick up here, a clear front piece. And I actually just added the steering wheel in the end, so I might actually take that off. And then this nice door that opens... And there's a Mando up here, which is actually the only gun part of the turret, which is why there needs to be two guys, one in there to drive and one up here. There is two. I'll show you the guy in here, but there's the Mando turret up here. can turn left and right and shoot stuff, and this Mando stands out here, stands on top of here. When he gets down, he uses these holes here, and he grabs onto them and goes down. That's why those holes are there, because everything on this has a purpose. And so, yeah, the door opens, and you can sort of see in there, but you see the Mandos sitting in there. Now I'm going to open up the roof, and we'll get a better view of the inside. Okay, so, whoa, I think this thing just came off, but the roof is just a plate, and then inside here, his jetpack, he threw it off before he got on that he could, um, kind of sit at the chair. There's a yellow chair there, some computerage, and then the steering wheel up front so that he can actually steer the thing. And there's the Mando right there. So now I can just kind of stick this back on. Now it's all back together again. Whoop, whoop. So now let's get on to the review of the RV. Okay, so here's the RV. It's slightly bigger than... Oh, sorry. Slightly bigger than the tank. And it contains most of their living areas. It has two sets of very small wheels. It's it's actually pretty long. It's two... Um, like, you, you know what these things are. It's like two of these lengths. And then it's got a wheel on each, and then a big buffer thing. Th this is not meant to go over tough terrains. This is just, like, basically the Mando's house. It has um, slightly less covering wallage. This window right here is placed there for a reason, because the bed is there. There's no wallage in the front or the back, though. 
and this is really weird wallage. As you can see, it's a lot more weird looking to make this look all old and beat up and stuff. And then here we have this nice little door, so that once it's attached, because when it's attached, you can't actually go through here, and if you just want to go through here, then that means that the tank isn't attached, and thus, there is no power going to this. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take off the roofs, because you cannot see anything in here with the roofs on. Okay, so there we go, I finally got the roofs off. Sorry about that, it actually took quite some time, because a lot of the pieces, like, fell off, so... Just normal plates for the roof. Not really much to that. And so inside here, up here first, we have a little table and then like a chair right there where they can sit at and they can like eat their food. Inside here is a little container thing, like a little refrigerator and it has a little crescent in there keep it nice and cool so that when they want to eat it come on close Ugh. whoops yeah um so okay this was just like broken right here and so I just had to fix it and so it was pretty fragile so that's just the story with that and then here's one bed cause one mando is meant to be on patrol while the other sleeps And okay. so I just gotta fix this for a second. And then also right here is just like a little empty canister thing where they can stick their stuff before they go to bed. So yeah, now I'm just gonna put this stuff back on and then I'll reattach them and show you a little test run of it. Okay, so yeah, that's like the whole thing again and you know it can just kind of move and stuff and it actually does turn quite well and then you can like have it turn it pivots like pretty well and then you can just kind of have it go around in circles and inside there you could see now you'd like need the door because like unless you want to like jump through there there's no other real way of getting in. So I hope you've enjoyed this review. That's all for today.